Hey guys, Colin here and uh, just wanted to share this with you for those of you that are trading uh, Bitcoin and cryptocurrencies. <coughs> Sorry about that. And uh, why I think there's a, a, a nice cool off coming, a cool down period coming with Bitcoin. Um, just looking at a very simple analysis here, let's show you something. We're talking about coming from $4,000, 30th of March. So call it, you know, less than 60 days ago. And going from 4,000 to 8,000, right? So that's pretty much a 100, 100% growth, right? Over the last two months. Now, there hasn't been, one, there hasn't been a proper correction since that time. Two, I'm looking at the daily chart, right? Look in the upper left-hand corner, you can see the daily chart. So at this point, let's look at this. It came up to, in, in trying to find out the, the, the peaks, right? Let's look at a quick tip here I'm gonna offer you all. Is that one, on the RSI, we realize that it has come back up to the, its previous high on the RSI. That was here, right? Last time it was here, it was only, you know, right here on the charts. When it came up, even though it came up on the same level on the RSI, it actually went significantly higher on the chart. However, as it came back down, this and this is the key that we're looking for. When it comes back down, we're looking for it to retest the previous high and see how that relates to the RSI. So right here, we realize that it's come back up to the previous high again, which was around 8,200. But on the RSI, it posted a lower high. So that is an indication that the turnaround is coming. All right. So uh, what I'm actually expecting from here, I'm expecting it. Of course, this is Bitcoin and, you know, it, anything can happen. Not investment, not investment advice, but just sharing with you all what I'm looking for. Right. Um, as I have a sell position in right now, I am looking for um, a dip back down to around the 7,000 level. It may come up and try to test one more time. It may, or it may just head right back down to the somewhere around the 6,200 level so that it can come here and make contact with this 50 day moving average. All right, by this point in time, it'll probably be somewhere around 6,200, which was the previous level of major resistance. So we're looking for that to become, to see if that will actually hold as some major support. Uh, but once again, this is my strong uh, indication that uh, a nice little correction is coming, okay? So I just want to share that with you guys.